After studying different types of clay for years, Jandar Furtun decided to make art with it in the 1960s. She exclusively produced ceramics and never sold any of her works. Now, Istanbul's Art and Museum is holding a retrospective exhibition. Two floors of works span six decades. In the 1960s and 70s, her works include things like a ceramic teapot set. But in the 1980s, Fortun started making fragmented human bodies. Loose limbs without definition. The change in her style is linked to Turkey's coup d'etat in 1980. Jandar Furtun forms groups of bodies and body parts out of clay. Each one looks alone, but they're together nonetheless. The bodies on the walls give off a sense of warmth. And here, you can almost hear the applause. The message of community is palpable. Fulton said that we can only heal if we stick together as a community. And the sense of unity is very prominent in each gallery room. For the exhibition's curator, Selen Ansan, this is an evolution of the artist's work. John de Furtun, who has installed her studio in the 60s in Shishli without moving from it, really, and who has witnessed her time in the studio with her works um, has also taken life and put it in her works. And I think this porosity, this permeability of her works, of her approach uh, with life has been very decisive in this transition between uh, abstraction and figuration. Ansan also says that the theme of the exhibition, Shell, represents the wall between the individual and the community. She also tells us that, you know, community is not a given thing. It's something you have to build. Although Ansan says Furtun's work doesn't explain how to build a community. Instead, it's meant to stimulate conversation. She doesn't give us an answer about how to build a community or to be together. I think she presents us with the struggles of the individuals to be together, each one and together. Although Ansen said the artist was only asking questions on how to become a community without losing the uniqueness of the individual, she and the other organizers of the exhibition said they wished this shell that they exhibit would lead to a social healing. Nursenat Tartiati World, Istanbul.